Hey everyone, I'm Yoshi Jibo, and this is It Never Ends, part 150. In this video about Dubai, I can see triangles as the logo for this advertising company. In this video about Dubai, I saw this tattoo on this guy, which shows an inverted cross again. Could that relate to the pyramids he has on his chest? What about the roses on his arm? Could that relate to the hand sign Don Tolliver is showing here? Kodak Black in the same video is no different. We also see this Ankh in an eye of Horus, black and white with themes of inversion, this hand sign again, and the vow of silence. Could it all relate to the hand sign Tom McDonald is showing here? What about the roses and the diamond the girl on the left has tattooed? Not to mention the alien tattoo the girl on the right next to her has. Rapper No Cap who I've covered a lot, I found out has two roses on his arm, with on his other arm, an all-seeing eye tattoo. Maybe that's why we see all of these signs here. Shorty Shorty can be seen doing this as well. And in the same video, we can see this woman here having a butterfly tattoo. In this video by Moneybag Yo, the guy that you're seeing here has a rose tattoo with a clock right above it. Maybe it relates to the spider web I've spoken about before that Moneybag Yo has. Maybe that's why he does this hand sign here. I mean, come on. Suicide Boys, who I've covered before, can be seen here showing black and white in their video. Not to mention the one eye. Could it relate to the one eye Victoria Monet shows? I mean, goodness. The fact that I'm flourishing with information this far into a series is absolutely mind-boggling. Could relate to the one eye this lady showing. What about the wing tattoo on her chest? Not to mention the rose on her arm, her neck, and her wrist. Maybe the clothing she's wearing on the left relates to the owl tattoo she has on her leg you can see on the right. Why does this lady here have two roses on her arm? Could relate to the all-seeing eye tattoo this lady has. What about the spider web on this guy's elbow? Could relate to why this guy here has two wings on his back? with a rose on his arm? Why does he have a rose on his neck? Could it relate to the rose and clock this guy has? What about the all-seeing eye on this guy's neck? Or the butterfly on this lady's arm? Why does the guy in the middle have an anchor tattoo on his neck, a diamond right beneath it, and wings on his chest? Could it relate to the two roses he has on his shoulders? He could be seen in this picture here, with the guy in the bottom right, who has an all-seeing eye tattoo in his chest and a rose tattoo in his wrist, maybe that's why this guy here has an all-seeing eye in him. Or why this guy here shows the vow of silence. Why does this guy have a wing tattoo in his chest? Could it relate to the all-seeing eye tattoo this lady has? What about the butterfly on her other arm or the wings we see on her chest? Could that relate to the one eye this lady showing? I believe so because she has wings on her neck, not to mention an anchor on her chest that has one eye on it. Maybe that's why she has a rose tattoo on her wrist or a spider web on her elbow. Could the owl tattoo that she has relate to any of this? As you can see, what I'm showing you is not a joke, and the title of the series is now cemented permanently as being the truth. Why does this guy here have a satanic tattoo on his forehead with two inverted crosses and an all-seeing eye on his chest. Could it relate to the X we see right beneath it? Why does this lady here have an inverted cross on her head? Could it relate to why the guy she's with here has an anchor tattoo on his face? What about the rose the girl has on her arm or the spider web on her elbow you can see here? What is with everyone having the same tattoos? Could it relate to why this guy here has a rose tattoo in his neck? What about the one eye this person showing? Could it relate to the wings or the crown we see on this guy? Why does this guy have something similar on him? Could it relate to the Egyptian tattoos on his arm? Why did basketball player Lamelo, who I've covered before, get this tattoo of an alien on his back with a UFO on his neck? I mean, come on, this alien stuff isn't even a joke. You see what you're seeing. Maybe that's why this lady, just like the other one I had just shown, has a wing tattoo on her neck. 
I believe so, because she has these tattoos on her stomach. Could that be why this girl to the left in this photo has a rose tattoo on her wrist? Maybe the rose she has relates to the Ankh tattoo she has, or this clothing here. Why does this lady here have two roses on her? Could it relate to why she's wearing the same clothes as the last lady? Why does the lady to the left have similar tattoos as what I've been showing? Could it relate to the butterfly on this person's stomach, or the one on their thigh? Why does rapper Rondo de Sosa, who I've covered before for having the skeleton tattoo on his wrist, start dating this woman here, who has butterflies tattooed on her? Could it relate to the spider webs on this guy's chest? What about the Ankh tattoo on this lady's wrist? Not to mention the butterflies she has here. Could that relate to the rose tattoo she has on her wrist? What about the diamond, or the lightning bolt we can see on her fingers? Maybe the one eye we see on her arm relates to the animal print tattoo she has. Why does this lady who I've covered before hang out with this lady to the left who has a butterfly tattoo on her? Could it relate to the wing tattoo on this guy's neck? What about the ones we could barely see on his chest? Could it relate to why this guy who I've shown before shows this hand sign? Or why this girl who I've also shown before has the sun and moon tattooed on her? As you can see, more Masonic duality. Could that relate to the butterflies this lady has? What about the spider web on this guy's arm? He also tattooed this on somebody. And this guy who I've covered a very long time ago has a spider web on his elbow. What's going on with these spider webs? Because seriously, something's going on. All of what you're seeing on screen are different people who I've never covered before. So that alone should make all of these other ones that I've shown much more questionable. Could the one eye that we see or aliens relate to any of it? Could it relate to any of what we see on the screen here? In each picture you see a different woman who I've never covered before, all showing some sort of symbolism. This group here, I've shown before for doing this hand sign, but in the same video, we can see this clothing, the Masonic sign of penalty, the six, and the one eye, which once again makes everything clear. Could any of this relate to the diamond tattoo on this lady's forehead? What about the rose tattoo on her wrist? Could that be why this lady here has two spider webs on each elbow? Or why this lady here has a butterfly tattoo? I believe so, because she has a rose tattoo on her neck. Could that be why this lady here, who has a butterfly on her neck, as well as the animal print on her arm, has roses on her? Or why Tom Grennan, who you see on the right, has a butterfly tattoo on his wrist? Why does this guy to the right here have an all-seeing eye on his knee and a spider web on his elbow? Could it relate to why in the same photo, the guy who you see on the left has the same spider web tattoo on him? I believe so because the guy in the middle, when I went to his Instagram, I found this other guy to the right who has a spider web on his elbow as well. Not to mention the roses on his back you can see. This guy, who I've covered a very long time ago, I found out has a spider web on his elbow. Could it relate to why this guy here has two all-seeing eyes on him? What about the third one we see on the back of his head? Could that relate to the wings we see on his back? Or guess what? The spider web on his elbow? Why does he have a rose as well? Could it relate to this fourth all-seeing eye tattoo he has on his leg? What about the tiger on his knee? Maybe that's why this lady here has roses tattooed on her. Or why this lady here has an all-seeing eye tattoo. Why does this guy here have a rose tattoo on his wrist? Could it relate to the rose tattoo on his neck? What about the vow of silence this guy has tattooed on his leg? Maybe the wings on this guy's chest? Or the all-seeing eye on his arm? I believe so because he has an all-seeing eye on his wrist as well. This guy who you can see here has a tiger tattoo on his knee, not to mention an anchor on his finger. Could this relate to the wings on his back? What about the all-seeing eye on his neck? He also has a spider web on his elbow. Could this relate to the double-headed eagle tattoo he has? What about the crown or the all-seeing eye? Maybe the spider webs above them relate to all of this. I believe so, because on the side of his arm, he has another all-seeing eye here. Could that be why the guy in the middle here has an all-seeing eye tattoo in his neck? Or why the guy right above him can be seen showing the vow of silence? 
Why does this guy here have an all-seeing eye tattoo with a butterfly connecting to the same sleeve? Could it relate to the rose on his chest? Why does this girl here have a skeleton tattoo on one of her wrists, a spider with a spider web on the other, with a rose on her finger, and finally wings on her chest? Could it relate to the roses this lady has tattooed on her chest? What about the butterfly on her wrist? I've already shown a very long time ago how some of my neighbors are associated to Freemasonry, but this should make it clear. The person who lived next door to me recently moved out, and conveniently, the person who moved in has direct ties to Freemasonry. It's hard to see, but on this van in which I blurred the license plate, you can see the Masonic symbol clearly seen. This should let you know that one, Freemasonry is everywhere, and two, it never ends.